In this video, we will walk you through the process of receiving on an open purchase order. So we'll get started by logging into receiving. Type the word next and go. We can skip over the first section and move to the packing slip. Your packing slip may reference your purchase order number and that will come in handy for the next section. So if we enter your packing slip number, and then we move down to the next section to enter your purchase order number. If your packing slip does not have your number, you can log into Finance Self Service and go into My Requisitions, go down to Completed Requisitions, locate your requisition number, and click on the Information button to locate the purchase order number. Once you've entered your purchase order number, go up to select Tools, scroll down and select purchase order items. So for an open purchase order, you may only have one line item that appears. Click on add item, select save in the lower right corner, we'll close the screen, select yes. And now we'll come down to the lower left corner to select the down arrow to move into the next section. So with the open purchase order, instead of receiving the number of items, we're going to receive the amount, the total amount of the purchase order that was processed. So again, refer to your packing list and locate your order total and enter that number. So my packing slip indicates that $173.77 was processed on this um, order. I have a total down here in the, the ordered section of $2,000 associated with this open purchase order. Once you've entered your amount, click tab or select the field here to populate your unit of measure. And now we're ready to attach our packing slip to the receiving document. Click Add in the upper section of your screen. And we're going to be taken into the extender application. So from here we're going to click on BF Docs over in the upper left corner. Select New Document. We'll enter our purchase order number here. For document type, we'll select purchase order. I'll click on the add page and I'm going to browse to find the document that I previously scanned to my computer. Select upload. And I'm just going to make sure that both pages of my packing slip have been uploaded, and they are. So now we'll select Save. Now we can exit out of the extender application and return to our receiving document. At this point, we have completed our process, and we select Complete. The next time you're ready to receive on another purchase order associated with this open order, you can repeat these steps.